Okay, so we have tiny bug in the code. And the first option is to set up wrapper inside of the child component. So again, our main issue is that we are invoking this where we have the on click. So in that case, it runs instantly. What's the solution? Well, in the child, we can come up with a different function. In my case, I'm going to call this get single book. And we'll invoke the get book inside of the function. So now we can pass the get single book, and we're good to go. You'll see that everything is actually correct. So let me just, I guess, comment this one out. Just in case you ever need it for your reference. So get book, get book, all that is good. But instead of invoking it, we're going to go with const get single book. Again, if you want to name this get my groceries, that's also going to work. The main point is that we want to invoke get book and grab the ID. Again, this will get us the ID that belongs to that component as we're iterating over list again. In the second component, it's not going to get the ID from the first one. That's the beauty of React. And instead of going with get book, we're going to go with get single book. And what do you know? Now, of course, everything is going to work. So I'll save. And once I click, check it out. This actually gets me the book with an ID of one. And it references the book that is inside of the component, which is just awesome. And of course, I can keep clicking, and I'm going to be getting this book. So let me, I guess, clean out the console. And if I'll click on a second one, hopefully you see where I'm going with this. And yes, eventually, this is how we can remove items from the list. Now, the logic is going to be a little bit different, but the idea is going to be the same. Again, the main thing that I'm trying to showcase over here is that we need to pass a reference. We cannot invoke the function right away. And as far as the second option, it's a little bit more challenging, I guess, as far as the concept where I can pass the anonymous function. So think of it this way. The general idea doesn't change. I still pass the reference. I'm just not naming it here. I pass in the anonymous function, and then I invoke it. So let's go back to index. And instead of get single book, which is a valid approach. Again, this really comes down to your preference. The reason why I'm showing you both of them, because again, as you're going to be looking at someone else's project, you will most likely see one of those approaches. So I just want you to be aware of them, where you can go with get book and then pass the ID. Same deal. Here is a reference. And inside of the function, that's when we invoke the book and check it out. Once I click again, I get the correct value in the console.